just taking a few deep breaths. So breathing in through our nose, Breathing back out through our nose if we can. If that doesn't feel good, you can breathe out through the mouth. Good. Good. Just finding some stillness. Let go of those wiggles. Now I want you to forget about your day, forget about school, forget about work, forget about wherever we've been. And just think about how brave you are for trying something new today, how brave you are for stepping inside the studio, whether it's your first time or your hundredth time. And let's take one last breath and then blink those eyes open. Let's start to move our hands. So I want you to roll out your wrists, open and close the fingers. Good. We're just going to start warming up everything nice and slow. Good. And then let's add our elbows in. So maybe we bend the elbows at the same time. Maybe we wiggle out those hands. Just starting to warm up your arms. I don't care what it looks like. I just want you to feel like you're moving around. Hi, come on in. Pick a spot, any open spot. Good. And then let's take it up into our shoulders. So maybe we make some arm circles. Maybe we crisscross. Doesn't matter what it looks like. I want you just to feel what you feel in your body right now. Are your arms tired? Is everything tight? Good. Feel free to twist if twists feel nice. Good. And then bringing it back through the center, let's take a side bend. So take your left hand down to the floor, reach that right hand up and over, reach, reach, reach. So really stretch out that right side of your body, but keep the right side of your butt pressing down into the floor. So don't let that hip lift, good. And then back through center, both hands up, let's switch. Right hand down, left hand up and over. Thanks, Jake. One more time, each side, left hand down, right hand up. Good. One more time, other way. Good. Now bringing it back to the top, let's interlace the fingers, press our palms to the sky, and then just make little side bends here. Thinking about keeping those arms tall, keeping those arms long. Good. And slowly take those hands down to the floor, roll yourself forward onto all fours. So hands and knees, I want you to make sure your shoulders are on top of our elbows, elbows are on top of our wrists. Good, spread those knees, hip distance apart, tuck your toes. Take a deep breath in. We're gonna find what we call cat cow. So we're gonna pull the chest forward between our arms, lift our butt, and then on our exhale, we're gonna round our back like a Halloween cat. Big deep breath in, pull that chest forward, gazing up. Exhale, rounding it out. Good, two more times, inhale forward, exhale round. Good, last one, in breath up, out breath down. Good, bringing it back to center, take that right hand out in front of you, reach it out, really, really strong, good. Can you pick up your left foot, extend it back behind you. So opposite hand, opposite foot. Think about your balance. Good, now we're gonna take right elbow to your left knee, give it a crunch. And then extend it back out for five. Crunch it in. Four, three, two, and one. Hold. Balance. Try not to wiggle. Now try to squeeze that stomach nice and tight. Hold, hold, hold. Good. Plug it in. Let's switch. So left hand reaches out. Thumb up, pinky down if you can. And then right leg shoots back. Opposite. Balance. And then crunch it out, elbow to knee for five, four, three, two, and one. Extend and hold, reach, 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 reach. Good, plug that hand back in, tuck those toes even stronger, lift your knees, lift your hips. So we're gonna find what we call downward facing dog here. It's a triangle shape in our body. And I want you to bicycle out your feet. So we're gonna pedal out those feet. Maybe moving the right leg, then the left leg. Good. Just pedaling everything out, moving around. Let's take one more breath here. And then look between your thumbs. We're gonna step, walk, or hop all the way to the top of your mat. 
Folding forward, hanging nice and heavy. Now move around here. So maybe opposite elbow, opposite hand. Maybe we rock, maybe we shake. Good. Twist it out. And then bending those knees, sweep up, rise up, reaching all the way up to the ceiling. Exhale, take your hands to your chest. Good, again, inhale, both arms up. Exhale, put a bend in those knees, swan dive down, reaching for your feet if you can touch them, your ankles or your shins if you can't. Inhale, halfway lift. So I want you to find a really flat tabletop back. Hands are gonna be on your knees or your shins. Good, and folds. Bend those knees, put your hands on the floor. Let's step back to our first plank. So in a plank, I want you guys to be really strong in the arms, keeping the shoulders over the wrists. Lift the knees up off of the floor. Lift the butt up just a little tiny bit. Nope, you stay, I'm just gonna walk. Good, you're gonna stay there the whole time, okay? So strong, strong, strong in the hands. Lift your butt up just a little bit taller, a little taller, a little taller. There you go, stay there, perfect. We're here for five, four, three, two, and one. Good, now bend your elbows just like a push-up. Lower yourself all the way to the floor. Good, straighten those arms. Lift that chest, we're gonna find upward facing dog. So relax your toes, pull that chest forward, big deep breath in. Tuck your toes, downward facing dog, lift your hips. Good. Let's do that one more time. Look between our thumbs, step, walk, or maybe we find a little bend in our knees and we can hop to the forward part of your mat, front part of your mat. Good, inhale, halfway lift, find that flat back. Exhale, fold. Bend those knees, take those arms all the way up overhead. Big deep breath. Exhale to our chest. Good, deep breath in, arms up. And fold, swan dive down. Inhale, halfway. Exhale, step back to our plank and hold. Last time here for a little while, I want you to think about pushing the floor away. So find that little Halloween cat rounding in our back. Really, really strong, good. Spread those fingers wide. Lift your heels towards the ceiling. So squeeze those kneecaps in towards your body. Feel that belly working really, really hard. And then here we go. Bend those elbows, lower yourself down. Maybe they touch your body the whole time. Can you keep them close? Good, relax your toes. Straighten your arms. Good, tuck your toes. Lift your hips, down dog. Good, pedal out your feet. Take a couple breaths here. Just stretch it out, notice what you feel. Do you feel your hips? Do you feel the backs of your legs, the fronts of your legs? Are your hands tired sitting here? What do you feel? Look between your hands, let's take it back to the top of our mat. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Bend those knees, sweep it up, rise up, all the way to the top. Good, take your hands to your chest. So we're gonna go through a circuit today. We're gonna work on some plyometrics. So we have a couple sets of exercises that we're gonna go through and then we're gonna stretch out in between. So first one, we're gonna find 15 air squats. We're just gonna take those feet hip distance, maybe a little bit wider, sit that butt back. When we stand up, one knee lifts, and then the other knee lifts. We're gonna go 15, okay? Take a deep breath in. Here we go, sitting it back. Good, counting it down if you want to. Five, four, three, good. Two, one, again, five, four, three, good, keep going. Two, and one, again, last five, four, three, two, and one. Sit it back, hold in our squats. We're here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, standing tall. Next move, I want you to find the middle of your mat. We're gonna move the right leg only. So right leg, hands on our hips, are gonna step forward, left knee drops, step it back, right knee steps back. Coming back to the center each time. If you feel comfortable, can you pass through center without dropping that foot? We've got 10 on the right, and we're gonna switch it up. Here we go. Right leg moves, deep breath in, Step it forward, step it back. Now our goal here is to stay in the same line each time. If you wanna find opposite arm, opposite hand, runner arms, working with that front knee, which is gonna change each time, we can find that. Let's go for three, 
two. Last one, step it forward, take it back. Bring it back to center, shake it out, move it around a little bit. And then we're gonna add on. This time we're gonna find jump squats, okay? With jump squats, I want you to think about landing soft and quietly in the feet. Let's try not to just slam down into the ground. So here's an example. Butt's gonna sit down, driving those hands back behind you, land soft, land with bent knees, try to absorb that impact. We've got 15 of these, here we go. Deep breath in, squatting it down, drive it up, fly those arms back, good. Nice, you guys, so quiet. Three, two, one, again, bless you. Five, four, three, two, one, last ones. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, sitting in our squat, hold, hold, hold. Three, two, one, standing up, shake it out. All right, so we're gonna find what we call a chair pose. I'm just gonna turn so I can see you guys better. So I want you to come to the top of your mat, front of your mat, take those feet together, knees together, ankles together, sit down in that same squat, but nice and narrow. Once you take those hands up overhead, good, feel that tailbone tucking under, feel your body really having to work here. Squeeze those legs towards one another. Deep breath in, deep breath out. Get high on your toes. So lift those heels. Balance, good. Awesome, you guys. A little bit lower. Drop your heels to the floor, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step back to your plank. Lower yourself down into your push-up. So bend those elbows, take yourself to the floor. Relax your toes, straighten your arms. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Pedal out your feet. Good. Big deep breath. Now we're gonna take that right leg up nice and high. So which is your right? Reach it up to the ceiling. Now look between your thumbs, step that right foot forward. We're gonna find a high lunge. So get that right foot to the top. Take those arms up overhead. Good. Now, right foot, remember, I'm not your mirror today, okay? So which is your right foot? Switch your feet in the gray sweatpants. There you go. Good. Now bend those knees, lift that back heel nice and high. Big deep breath, good. Fly those arms back behind you. Beautiful, hold. Don't let your chest rest. We're just gonna hold here for five, four, three, two, and one. Kick that left heel down, open up, warrior two. So our right knee, is gonna be bent, right toes face towards me. So give me your front leg, front knees, bend them towards me. Good, straighten that left leg, big deep breath, right hand in front, left hand behind. Get a little bit deeper into that front knee, good. Take your left hand to the back of your left leg, reach that right hand towards the back of the room. Big, reaching back, good. Big deep breath. Coming back to your warrior two, Cartwheel those hands down to the floor, lift your left heel, step back to your plank. Bend your elbows, lower yourself down. Inhale, up dog, straighten your arms. Exhale, down dog, lift your hips. Good. Take a deep breath, and then look between your thumbs. Let's come back to the top of our mat, all the way to back to the front. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Bend those knees, sweep it up, rise up all the way to the top, thumbs to your chest. Let's go through those squats again. This time we're working on the left leg. So feet hip distance. We've got 15 of those squats, lifting alternating knees. So here we go. Sit that butt down, left knee and right knee. Good. Now if you wanna find elbow to knee, add on and make it a little bit more of a crunch, go for it. We've got seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. Good, center of your mat, left leg moves. So put that right foot into the floor. We're stepping that left foot forward, left foot back. Here we go, deep breath in. We've got 10, good, nine, eight, seven, Six, good, try to keep those knees spread apart just a little bit. Five, 
four, three. Good, you guys. Last two. One more. Good. Back through center, shake it out. Good, take a breath. We're going back to those air squats or the jump squats, okay? Just as quiet, just as strong as the first round. Here we go. Sit that butt down low, hands down, and drive it up for five, four, three, two, and one. Again, for five, four, three. Good job, you guys. Two. How high can you get on these last five? Four, three, two, and one. Good. Deep breath in. Good. Hold. Shake it out. Then meet me at the top of your mat. Let's find our chair. We're going to go through our stretch and then get a water break. So feet together. Take those hands up overhead. Sit down in your chair. Good. Sit that butt back like you're sitting in a bucket. Sitting on a chair. Fly those arms back behind you. So reach, reach, reach. Flat back. Inhale. Take those arms up. Deep breath in. Exhale. Straighten your legs. Forward fold. Inhale. Halfway lift. Exhale. Step back to your plank. Lower yourself down into your push-up. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Lift your hips. Pedal out your feet. And then when you're ready, take your left leg up to the sky. So reach it, reach it, reach it. Look between your thumbs. Put that left foot forward. Step it between your hands. Good. Get that left leg up there, guys. Left leg in front. Step it up. Good. Take those arms up overhead. Deep breath in. Find a big, strong lunge. Can you squeeze that right butt? Lift that right heel nice and high. Good. Big deep breath. Take those arms back behind you. Flat back, strong arms. Good. Hold for three, two. Open up into your warrior two. So spin that right heel down, left leg, left toes bend towards me. So give me that front knee, front leg. Bend it nice and strong, good. Left hand in front, right hand behind. Get him to hide your shoulders. There you go, good. Right hand to the back of your right leg. Reach that left arm up. Good. For those of you reaching towards me, switch the other way. Right hand down, left hand up, good. Take those hands back to the floor. Cartwheel them all the way down. Step back to your plank, bend your elbows. Lower yourself down. Inhale up. Exhale, down dog. Good. If you need a water break, drop your knees. Take some water. If you need a towel, towel yourself off. Good job, you guys. Did everybody bring water? Did nobody bring water? Okay. Next time, bring water with you, okay? You're welcome to bring it in here. That's okay. All right. So, we're going to take it into our upper body now, okay? So, we're going to find... Move number one, what we call kick sits. So we're going to have hands flat on the floor, and facing you, it's going to be a little bit different. So bear with me, okay? We're going to find those knees lifting, hovering just a couple inches up off of the floor. We're going to try to cross. Left foot down, right foot kicks. Right foot down, left foot kicks. So we're just going to kick and kick side to side. For those of you that want to take it up a notch, we're going to kick side, opposite hand picks up. Whatever way you're facing, that top hand picks up, okay? So here we go. I'm going to move to the back of the line. Are you guys okay if I leave you with those? Okay, here we go. So find yourself on all fours, lifting those knees, and hover, hold. So really strong, flat back. Take your left heel, spin it down to the floor, toes to the left, kick that right foot through. Balance, good. Bring it back through center and switch. Right heel down, kick that left foot through. Right and left. Can we go a little bit quicker? Here we go. Left, right, left, right. Good. Breathe and move. Now maybe you can pick up one hand as you kick it to the side. Can we add on a little bit? Nice. Some of you nailed this. Good, you guys. Let's go for five, four, three, two, and one. Drop your knees. Rest. Good. All right, move number two. We're going to flip onto our butts. So go ahead and sweep those feet around. Sit onto your butt. And we're going to take those hands behind us. 
fingers facing toward your body. We're gonna press those feet flat down into the floor. So we're looking to make almost a reverse tabletop. Thank you, Jacob. Okay, so we're gonna take elbows, bend them to the back of our body. When we lift it back up, opposite hand, opposite foot. So bend and tap. Takes a lot of stomach strength and a lot of balance, okay? So let's give it a try. Do a couple reps on your own, and then we'll start our timer. Here we go. Good, so find that balance. Take your feet a little bit wider. Spread those feet, give you a little bit more of a foundation. Good, okay, you got this, come on. So here we go, we're gonna go for about 30 seconds, okay? Deep breath in, here we go. Lift those hips, bend your elbows, drop your butt, pick them back up, and tap. Good, bend, dip, and tap. Perfect, so once you feel like you've got it, can we? Just alternate a little bit quicker. Can we get a little higher? Good, there you go. Opposite hand, opposite foot. So different hand, different foot. Switch. So right hand, left foot. Right hand, left foot, tap them. Pick it up, pick it up. Yes, there you go. Good, you guys about halfway there. Lift, good. Balance is hard, huh? Here you go, good. There you go, try to keep those heels down on the floor if they're not lifted. We've got five, four, three, two, and one. Rest, settle, good, okay. Last move in this sequence. We're gonna find legs out in front of us this time. Same idea, fingers toward our body, and we're gonna lift, kind of like a reverse plank, okay? If this is enough, stay here, keep those hips high. If you want more, I want you to bring alternating knees to your nose. Feet can be flexed if that feels better on your knees. Okay, so play around here. But we're gonna try to just march it out, keeping that butt as high as we can. Arms don't have to bend, okay? Here we go, deep breath in, find that reverse plank. Draw those knees in. Jacob, get that butt higher. Yes, good, go ahead guys, perfect. Good, can you bring that butt just a little bit higher? Push, yeah. Good, there you go, draw those knees in. Now, can we be a little bit quicker? Can we crunch and extend, crunch and extend? There you go, crunch it in, good. Good, you guys halfway there. Good, yes, good, don't kick yourself. <laughs> good, we've got five, crunch them in. Four, three, two, drop those elbows, drop those knees, whatever you got up, take it down and relax. Shake it all out, good. Take a deep breath in, and then meet me at the top of your mat. Let's find our chair. So make your way back to the front of your mat. Sit that butt down, nice and low. Find your chair, knees together. Good, big deep breath here. Now fly those arms back, folding forward. Inhale, take those arms up, lift your heels up. Can we balance so, so strong here? Good, drop your heels, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step back to your plank, lower yourself down into your push up. All the way to the floor, elbows stay close. Good. Inhale, relax those toes, upward facing dog, downward facing dog. Good. Take a big deep breath in, lift that right leg up to the sky. Reach, reach, reach. I'm pulling on your big toe. Reach. Look between your thumbs, put that right foot between your hands. Step it forward. Inhale, take those arms up, find your high lunge. Now deepen that bend in your right knee. So bring those knees up a little bit higher. Good, there you go. Now I want you guys to take your feet on railroad tracks, okay? So if you look like a ballerina on a tightrope, it's not gonna work. Take those feet wider, railroad tracks, arms up. Good, now reach those arms out towards me, leaning forward this time. We're gonna draw that back knee, left knee, in towards our chest, and then extend it back out. We've got 10 of these, here we go, deep breath in. Exhale, pull for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, ooh, four, three, two, and one. Extend it back out, take those arms up, deep breath in. Good, let's find our warrior two. So kick that left heel down, right hand in front, right knee bends, give me your right toes. Good, deep breath in, hold. Left hand down, right hand reaches back. Good. 
Now take that right elbow to your right knee, lay it on that right knee and reach your left hand towards me. Good, big deep breath, stretch out the left side of our body. Let's do that again, reverse, left hand down, right hand reaches back, right elbow, right knee, bring it in, left hand towards me. Good, now try not to collapse here, guys. If your ear is collapsed and we're lazy, try to be really, really strong here. One more time, left hand down, right hand up, reach. Good, hand, elbow to knee, forearm to thigh, left hand in front. Big deep breath, good. Bring it back up, warrior two. Cartwheel those hands down to the floor, lift that left heel, runner's lunge. So I want you to find this real strong sprinter's lunge, hold. Good, step that left foot forward, find your chair. Take those arms up overhead, good. Now everybody has a block. I want you to reach down, grab your block, and we're gonna put it between our thighs, right above our knees, and we're gonna squeeze as we find that chair. Now your feet are gonna be able to touch. There's gonna be a little space, that's okay. So sit that butt down nice and low. Now I want you to squeeze, we're here for a full minute. Don't let that block move. Squeeze it as tight as you can, in through the center. Good. Really engage those inner thighs, all the in. How far back can you sit that butt back? Yes. Good. You too. Sit that butt back like you're sitting on a bucket back behind you. Good. Big deep breath. Try to keep that back nice and straight. Hands can be at your chest if you need a little bit of a break, okay? Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Don't let it fall. Good. Hold. I know it burns. Big deep breath. Now keeping that block there, let's add on a little bit. Stay low, stay low. Can you take a right foot? And left foot, it's a little movement. Can you keep those arms up? Good, we've got 10, nine, don't miss out. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Drop that block, let it go. Woo, move it out to the side, forward fold. Hang nice and heavy, you guys. Woo. Inhale, halfway lift, find that flat back, hands to your shins. Step back to your tabletop, so on all fours. Bend those knees, put them on the floor. So we've got one more round of those upper body moves that we did, starting with the kick sit, where our hands are down, and we're gonna kick that foot through each side, okay? So meet me in your all fours. Here we go, about 30 seconds. Deep breath in, lift those knees, hover, and let's cross it under. Right foot, left foot, right foot, left foot. Good, try to keep a flat back the whole time. Good. Maybe you can find opposite hand, tapping opposite toe when you get good at this or comfortable with this move. Good, halfway there. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Good, kick that foot through. Really nice, you guys. Let's go for five, four, three, two. Drop your knees, rest. Good, flip over, sit on your butts. So we're gonna find those feet flat on the floor, that reverse tabletop, and we're gonna tap opposite hand, opposite foot, okay? See if you can put a little bend in your elbows, lower yourself down, and then lift it back up when we tap, okay? Here we go, front row, high as you can, guys. Deep breath in, and let's move. Tap them out, good. Now remember, the wider we go in our hands and our feet, the better balance we have. If we stay really close, we can't move very well. So take those feet wide, take up space. Lift, 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 halfway there. Good. So strong, you guys. Good, squeeze your tummy nice and tight, almost like you're gonna get punched in the stomach. Find that little uh, tuck to help you balance. Five, four, three, two, and one, rest. Drop it down. Let's take butterflies in our legs just to get a break. Whew, feet together. Good, breathe. And then when you're ready, we have one last move before a water break, okay? So hands back behind, find that reverse plank, and bring those knees in towards your chest, one at a time. Let's go 15 reps. Whatever time frame that takes for you, it's totally okay. Here we go, lift those arms, elbows up, knees move. Good, for four, three, two, and one. For five, four, three, try to get your butt up off the floor. Two, and one, last five, four, 
three, two, and one. Drop it down. Everybody reach for your toes. Folding forward. If you can't reach your toes, just reach for your knees, your shins, your thighs, whatever you can reach. Just let your head fall down. Take one more breath. Good. Walk your hands back up. Crisscross at your ankles. We're going to roll ourselves forward, getting ready to find our chair. So bring yourself forward. Lift those hips. Sit down in our chair. Let's finish this, and we get water. So sit that butt down nice and low. Good. Big deep breath. Fly those arms back behind you. Flat back. Strong in the tummy. Strong in the upper half. Arms up overhead. Lift your heels. Good. Big deep breath. Drop those heels forward, fold, hanging heavy. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, step back, take your plank, and then lower yourself down into your push-up, nice and slow. Good. Inhale, straighten the arms. Downward facing dog, lift your hips. All right, let's go left leg. So take that left leg up, look between your thumbs, step that left foot forward, find that high lunge. Inhale, take those arms up. Good. Big deep breath, big strong lunge here. How strong can we find? Leaning forward, let's bring that right knee to our chest. Here we go. For 10, nine, shoot it back. Eight, seven, good, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Hold, take those arms up overhead. Big deep breath, good. Warrior two, opening towards the door. So take that left, or excuse me, right heel down. Left hand in front, right hand behind. Bend that left knee nice and deep. Good, left toes towards me. Right toes towards the door. Guys, so even more, open it up a little bit more. Yeah, there you go. Good, you guys. Take your left knee, turn it towards me. Left knee, left toes. Yeah, there you go. Good, a little bit deeper. Good, now take your right hand down to the back of your right leg. Reverse, reach that left hand back. Good. Left elbow to your left knee. Reach that right hand out to the front. Good. Again, reverse. Right hand down. Left hand up. Left elbow down. Right hand reaches up. One more time. Reach that right hand back. And cartwheel it down. Good. Coming back up. Warrior two. And then take those hands down to the floor, step forward to your chair, grab your block. One more time, put that block between your thighs, between your knees, and hold. This time, I wanna see how low you can get into your chair while still being mindful of our knees, still being mindful of our body. So stick that block in there, sit that butt low. Good, hands don't have to be out, but if you want more, can you take those hands out in front of you? Good, can you lift your heels? Hold, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze like crazy. Don't let it go. Can we lower our hips to our heels and then stand back up? Ooh, good. Lower hips to heels, maybe the heels drop. Stand it back up. Two more times. Lower it down. Squeeze, don't let it fall. Bring it back up. One more time, lower. Bring it back up. Drop that block, let it go. Good, take a deep breath. Forward fold, hanging heavy, drop your head. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Good job, you guys. Bend those knees. Take those hands up overhead. Sweep up, rise up. Thumbs to your chest. Grab a drink of water. Good. Take a breath, take a break. About 30 seconds here and we'll finish strong. Where are we going? Okay. Huh? No clue. Okay, here we go in Shavasana. No, just kidding. All right, so let's add on our last little leg circuit, okay? Let's burn it out. So we're gonna find squat jumps again, but I want you to start at the back of your mat, and we're gonna squat jump all the way to the front of our mat. We're gonna shuffle it back, and then squat jump to the front, okay? We're gonna find, <laughs> careful, we're gonna find 10 of these. When we squat though, try to keep the legs wide, landing soft, and then shuffle it back, reset. Okay, 10 of these, here we go. Deep breath in, starting at the back, get low, 
Drive those hands forward. Good, shuffle it back. How soft can you land? Here we go, woo, careful. Slow it down, slow it down. Now remember these mats are slippery, so be careful. Good, this is four, take it back. We've got five. Good, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Hop it forward, land soft, land controlled. Good, keep those feet wide. What number are we on? Somebody count it down. Here we go. Good, shuffle, shuffle. Here's eight. Take it back, almost done. Last two, hop it forward. Good, shuffle it back. Quick feet, quick feet, light on your toes. Last one. Hop it forward, take it to the back of your mat. Breathe. Hands to your hips or hands up overhead. Deep breath. Next move, where we're going, take a peek. So we're gonna find switch lunges this time. It's gonna look like right leg in front, left arm in front. We're gonna get real low here in our squat. We're gonna take a deep breath in and then switch hands and feet. Switch, switch. Landing soft, trying not to slam into the floor. Trying to land quiet, find a little bounce, okay? If jumping doesn't work, I just step, find a modification, okay? All right, we've got 15 of these. To, actually, let's make it 16, let's even it up. Here we go, right foot in front, left hand in front. Deep breaths, and switch, here we go. 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, come on, 3, 2, one, rest, shake it out. All right, best one for last, okay? We're gonna find what we call squat 180s. So we're gonna stay facing the front of our mat. We're gonna squat down nice and low, and we're gonna find a jump squat all the way facing the back of our mat, back to the front of our mat, and to the back of our mat, okay? Any questions? Let's go 10 of these. One forward, one back is one. Okay, forward back two, forward back three. You've got 10 of these. Take a deep breath, take your time. Everybody facing the front first. Here we go, deep breath and hop and switch. Good, for one and two, Good. three, four, five, six. How high can you get? Seven, yes, eight. Nine, good, feel free to use your arms any way you're comfortable with. 10, halfway, good, and rest. Good, you guys, beautiful. So we're turning all the way to the back, all the way to the front. Step to the front of your mat, find your chair. Take a deep breath, a big, big inhale. Take those arms up overhead, reach, good. Fly those arms back behind us. Lift those heels as you take the arms up overhead. Ooh, balance. Good, drop those heels, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Step back to your plank, lower yourself down. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog. Deep, deep breath. Right leg lifts, reach, reach, reach. Look between your hands, step that right foot forward. High lunge, take those arms up, good. And then let's open up into our warrior two. So left toes to the window, right knee, right toes towards me. Bend that front knee, nice and deep. Right hand in front, left hand behind. Reverse, left hand down, right hand up. Good, right elbow, right knee. Take it down, good. Come back up to your warrior two and hold. Good, now we're gonna bend into that left knee, find a side lunge into the left knee. So Jacob, show us how it's done. Side lunge, bend that left side. Yep, straighten that right leg. So can we take our left side of our butt, sit it on our left heel? Can we take our right toes, point them up towards the ceiling? Good, big deep breath. Left hand down inside that left knee. Right hand reaches up. Good, hold. Reach for your right toes. Can we think of flat back here, reaching for those right toes? Maybe you can't reach the toes, we reach our shin, our ankle, our knee, whatever you got. One more breath. Good, bring those hands back down in front of our body. We're gonna press back up into warrior two. So if you don't need to use your hands, don't use your hands, but push, re-bend that front knee, take it back up. Good, high lunge, lift that left heel, take those arms up.
Step yourself forward, standing tall at the top of our mat. Good, big deep breath. We've got that leg circuit one more time, all the way through. Who remembers what move number one was? Not you? Anybody? Good. What do you got? There you go, back of your mat. So we're gonna hop it forward, shuffle it back. We've got 10 of these. Deep breath in, this is our last hard stuff right here. Step it to the back, deep breath in, hop it forward, shuffle it back. Good, now can we land with both feet at the same time? Let's move. Go ahead, hop it forward. Good, try to keep those feet wide. Don't be afraid to jump. Good, hop it forward, shuffle it back. Good, nice and soft landing. There you go. Good, when you've got your 10, stay at the top of your mat, stand tall. Good, nice, Chad. What do you got, Jake, you got 10? Yeah. Give me 12, give me 15, go. You got more, you got more. There you go, come on. Good, nice, Melissa, I like that. Good, once you get your 10, Stop at the top of your mat. Good, you guys. All right, we got those switch lunges. So take a breath, and then we're gonna find hopping your opposite foot each time. So maybe right leg in front, left leg in front, your choice. Here we go. We've got 20 total, left and right. Let's burn it out. Deep breath in, and hop. Let's go 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, 10 more, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, last one, rest. All right, who remembers the last move? What do we got? Back of our mat, front of our mat, right? Okay, how many you guys wanna do? What do we think? 12, I like 12, okay. 12 forward, 12 back, all right? Here we go, take a deep breath. Everything you have right here, okay? Everything you got left in the tank, let's empty it. Deep breath in, stand into the front, sit it down. Here we go, and turn, good. To the front, there's one. Take it back, two. We've got three, four, come on girls. Five, yes, six, there's seven. Eight, land soft, land soft. Nine, ooh, 10, last two. 11, and 12, good. Find your chair, top of your mat. Big deep breath. Let's stretch it out, we'll sit, drink, slow down. Arms up overhead, big deep breath. Drink your breath here, inhale. Folding forward, lift your heels. Take those arms up overhead, good. Drop your heels, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lift, step back to your plank, lower yourself down. Whew. Good, stretch out your belly here. Tuck your toes, down dog, good. Here we go, left leg lifts, reach, reach, reach. Step that left foot between your hands, good. Find that high lunge, take those arms up overhead. Inhale up, nice and strong. Left leg in front. Open up into your warrior two. Right toes towards the doors. Left knee, left toes facing front. Reverse, right hand down. Take that left hand up. Good, left elbow, left knee. Reach that right hand out. Back up to your warrior two. Good, now bend into that right knee. Sit your right hip all the way down on that right heel. Perfect. Can you lift your left toe, careful. Lift your left toes up towards the ceiling. Good, right hand stays down. Can you twist that left arm up? Big deep breath. Good. Now can you take that left hand, reach for your left toes, your left shin. Good, hold, really strong, flat in your back. Good. Beautiful, you guys. Take those hands back down in front of your stomach. Press yourself back up into your warrior two. Left knees, left toes facing the front. Good. Cartwheel those hands down to the floor. Step back to our last plank. Good, lower yourself down into your push-up. Drop those feet, inhale, up dog. Exhale, down dog, one last time. Good, lift that butt nice and high. Take a deep breath. Good, drop your knees to the floor. We're gonna find child's pose. So I want you to take those knees wide, big toes together, sit your hips onto your heels, foreheads down on the mat. Just take a deep breath, all the hard stuff. 
is done. Slow it down. Good. Try to breathe in through your nose, back out through your nose. Try to slow down our breathing. All that hard stuff, we tend to breathe out through our mouth. So try to slow it all down, out through the nose. Good. Now take both hands, reach them over to the right side of your mat. So maybe we find this little side bend with those hands reaching out to the side. Good. Reaching longer through that left middle finger than anything else. One more breath. And then let's take it the other way. Reaching to the left, to reaching out that right middle finger, trying to square that right shoulder down still if we can. Good. Yeah. Rest those hips under your heels. Just soften. Good, guys. Slowly lift yourself back up. And let's make our way onto our butts laying down onto our backs. So go ahead and roll yourself onto your back and then pull your knees in towards your chest. Front row, if there's anything else you guys wanna take, feel free to find whatever options you choose today. But the rest of you guys, go ahead and lay flat. Pull those knees in towards your chest, give yourself a big hug. So lay all the way onto your backs. Yeah, there you go, now pull those knees in. Try to wrap your arms around your knees, find a little tight ball that you're wrapped up in. Good. Now kind of rock side to side a little bit, maybe forward and back. Good. Good job, you guys. Nice job, front row. Looks good, Jacob. Good. Really nice, you guys. Now take those arms out nice and wide, girls. Reach those arms out like airplane arms. Good. Now put both feet flat on the floor, just like this. So I want knees flat up to the ceiling. Let both knees drop over to the left side of your mat. Just stack those knees and hold. So we're gonna take a little twist. Arms don't change, keep those arms out. Good, there you go. Let's take one more breath here, nice and big. And then let's take that twist to the other way. So bring those knees back up through center and then drop those knees over to the right side, stacking left knee on top of your right. There you go. And then keeping those arms open, just twisting out our back, twisting out our stomach. Good. Nice happy baby, Melissa. Good job, you guys. Bringing it back through the middle, put your feet back flat on the floor, knees up to the ceiling. Take a deep breath. Good, now we're gonna find what we call Shavasana, and that's our last resting pose. Before we leave the studio and go down to the cages, I want you to lay down, put those feet out in front of you, just let them flop open towards the edges of your mat. Take those hands, palms up, just flop open. I'm gonna turn out the lights, and we're just gonna lay here for a few minutes, give us a chance to rest, okay? Close those eyes, and I want you just to soften, no, you're okay. I want you just to soften your breathing. Try to let your breathing come back to normal before we head down to the cages. So let's start with a big, long inhale, big, long exhale, as those lights start to go out. Good. Now I know it seems a little silly to be sitting here in the dark, I know. So try to let go of any wiggles, let go of any giggles, if you can and just rest. Be respectful of everybody else in class, not just of your teammates. But let's take a big deep breath in together. Inhale through the nose. Exhale, let it go. Good. Now while you lie here for just a few minutes, I want you just to listen to the ocean. You're gonna hear the ocean in the background of the music to see if you can find the waves. When do the waves crash on the shore? Maybe you imagine yourself sitting on the beach right now, watching those waves. Can you hear them? What do they look like? Maybe there's a breeze that blows through your hair, blows across your face. Maybe you're at your favorite beach. Where is it? Maybe you're sitting next to a sand castle with your toes in the sand. 
Maybe you're in a beach chair, on a towel. How do you like to sit at the beach? And if you've never been to the beach, maybe imagine what it would be like. What do you think it feels like? What do you think it sounds like? Good. Maybe there's seagulls, kids, kites. What else is happening around you? Good. I'm gonna leave you here on the beach just for a few moments. Stay right where you're at. I will invite you back when the time is right. Just breathe, listen for the waves. I'll find one more wave and then take a deep breath in. Take a deep breath out. We'll start to add some movement back into our body. So wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes, make circles in your wrists, circles in your ankles. Good. Maybe bend your knees, put your feet flat on the floor, bend your elbows. Good. And then pull your knees in towards your chest, wrap your arms around your knees. Find some rocking side to side, forward and back. Good. And then make your way up, use your hands, roll onto your side, push yourself up towards a comfortable seated position facing the front of the room. So in class, we'll take one last breath together and we'll find our closing. So deep breath in, take those arms up overhead. Exhale, take your thumbs to your chest. So for those of you that are just joining us for the first time today, at the end of class, we say the word namaste. And the word namaste means that the good in me, the light in me, the athlete in me sees that in each one of you and together we respect that in one another. So if you want to participate, you do not have to. We take our thumbs to our forehead, we bow to one another and say namaste. Good job.